Hi everyone, this is Emmy. Today I'm going to show you how to crochet this little shaggy dog. So let's get started. To make this little dog, you're going to need either a bottle or a can as the base. And today I'm going to use a can. And I just traced around on a piece of cardboard and I cut it out and I taped it to the top of the can like that. And then I crocheted a section that was going to wrap around the can like this to cover the can. And to start out, I worked a foundation chain that's going to reach from the center of the bottom of the can to the center of the top. And then I single crocheted in the second stitch from the hook and each stitch all the way across the row. All the way across the row. And then I chained one and turned and I single crocheted in each stitch across the row but I only worked in the back side of the stitch and every row will be exactly the same. Chain one and turn, single crochet in each stitch all the way across the row, working only in the back side of the stitch. Until you have a piece that's like this and it will wrap around your container like that. So now I'm going to fold it over like this and I'm going to slip stitch all the way down to form a tube. So slip stitch, insert in one stitch, insert on the other side, pull right through. Okay, I slip stitched all the way down and now at this end I'm just going to close the bottom and I'm going to slip stitch in every second or third stitch like that. Pull that end inside and I'm going to slide my container inside. I threaded a small piece of yarn into a needle and I'm going to close this end. I'm just going like that. So now I'm going to measure from here to the bottom. And I'm going to cut a piece of cardboard that's that length and I'm going to wind around this cardboard like that. Tie it here into a bundle and cut it off. And I wound it around 40 times but you want enough that will probably be a circle in your hand. And now I'm just going to measure like this and I'm going to cut my cardboard and I'm going to wind my yarn around and I'm going to make two bundles like this. Tie it off, cut it open and I'm going to make one more like this. Okay, so I have one long one and two shorter ones. Okay, so now I'm ready to start putting it together. So here on the top, I'm going to take my longest section and I'm going to glue it here on the top. Like that. Take a smaller section and I'm going to glue it here. So right approximately here. And then I'm going to turn it over and I'm going to glue this section here. Like that. Okay, so here's what I have. I glued this long one on the top and then on the front I glued the shorter one and on the back I glued another shorter one. So here on the front I'm going to take this top part and I'm going to divide it into three like that and I'm going to take approximately a third from the back and I'm going to bring that over to the top as well and tie this into a little top bundle and then trim this off evenly. So now there's the two sections that we divided off. We're just going to bring those down like that. 
and I have a small piece of red felt and I'm going to glue it right there. I'm going to glue a pom-pom for the nose. And I have two more pom-poms and I'm going to glue those there for the eyes. And I have a red bow and I'm going to glue that right there. And now I'm just going to go all the way around and I'm going to arrange this down and glue it in place.